Now I've had a couple of requests lately for a nice, simple fish dish. People said to me, we never cook fish at home, it's too complicated. Now I have shown you, in days gone by, you know, that lovely steamed fish with the soy and the, and the ginger. But this one is just, it's just pan fried fish and it really is very easy. Of course you have to go to a good fishmonger. And the other thing that's important is you start off the good side of the fish. I know this sounds ridiculous, but the one that's going to look the best, you start off by putting that in the oil. And now I'm just starting off with olive oil in a pan. And we, as I said, see that's the better side of the fish, isn't it? And we then add some salt. And some pepper. And I'll, and I'll season the other side when I turn it. So we'll turn that down a bit, because that's going a bit fast. And you don't need to add any butter at this stage, because I am going to add butter later on, because I'm doing fish meniere, which means lemon butter. I think it does. <laughs> of course it does, Ian. Now, two things. Don't overcook the fish, because what happens is when you remove it from the heat source, it will continue to cook. So be a bit careful about it. All right. And just keep back a bit because the fish has always, always got a bit of water, a bit of moisture. And as you can see, it's crackling away. So you end up with half of it on your shirt. All right, I'll turn it once more to see how we're going. Now it's very close. Yeah. It's a bit when when you press it, what do you feel of it if it's really springy, it's still under. It needs to be a bit firm to the touch, so we're not far off. We're not far off. Now we're looking pretty good. Let's just grab our plate. Ooh, that looks nice. I would happily eat that. <laughs> now, I'm going to pour most of this oil off because I am going to make a butter. Now, you can leave a little bit of the oil in there, but not too much. And so, a decent amount of butter can go in. Also, some fresh lemon juice. By the way, this is blue eye. So, any steaky fish, blue eye, groper, barramundi, you name it. And what I'm also going to add is some fresh lemon juice. Quite a bit of that. And I want a sort of a brown butter, you know, I want it to cook a bit. I don't want it black. See, that's enough. By the time that little bit there melts, that will be exactly what we're after. And some chopped parsley in there. And we're talking about a really simple fish dish with a lemon butter. My friends, I reckon that's a good tucker. I really, really do. Serve it with something simple like some sauteed potatoes or even some chips. You know, buy good McCain's chips and fry those or, you know, oven chips you can buy. Or even just a nice salad. Whatever you like. All right, guys. I almost forgot the wine because that's, that's very important because we've got our fish. And I'm showing off a bit today because to go with that, I've got a lovely French Chablis which I adore. Chablis, of course, is Chardonnay. Unwooded. All right, there we go, guys. Chablis, piece of blue eye, lemon butter. It doesn't get much simpler than that, and it doesn't get much tastier either. Guys, to show your support for my channel and to keep in the loop, subscribe. It's easy to do and don't forget, it's free. Okay, cheers.